Welcome back everyone to the Whitsunday's Carts and Parts Great Barrier Reef Titles for 2021 and out come the first of the Junior Classes Looks like we've got the KA4s, KA3 and KA4 Heavies out there at the moment They all come past me KA3, KA4 Junior Light, KA4 Junior Heavy all make their way out onto the circuit. The second qualifying session underway then. And they'll all just come round and do another warm up lap for sure. It might be two laps they get in before the timing is switched on. Starting to really wind it up already, so. No, uh, no messing around. They all steam past me. On track, we've got Cruz, the Missile Mason. That's in the KA3 Juniors. There he is. In the KA4 Junior Lights, we've got Cody. Metcalf, G.I. Finch, Adane Stevens, Jure Portelli, Jury Portelli, Kai Brennan, Charlie Ernst, Joey Metcalf, and Damian White. And in the heavy, the KA4 Junior Heavy, Dan the Man Spurway. They are the drivers, all out now then, and first up, Cruise the Missile has done a 44 dead, 44-0-0-8. Sam Spurway is about to go over the line. What does he do? Waiting, waiting. 45-636. And in the KA4 Junior Light, Elaine Stevens has gone straight to the top of the timing. Metcalf's gone P2. Damian White's gone P3. Ty Finch gone P4. Portelli 5. Brennan 6. Metcalf 7. Ernst in 8. That is your order in the KA4 Junior Lights. Finch or Portelli's gone up to three. Jury Portelli, she's gone to three now, back to four, as Damien White has gone to the top. The White Meister has gone to the top of the timing in the KA4 Junior Lights. There he is. As they go through Bendigo Bank, heading up to Side Fix Solutions. Mason, 43, 974. Spurway, 45, 4, 9, 0. And in the KA4 Junior Lights, it's still White, Metcalf, Stevens, Portelli, Finch, Brennan, Metcalf, Ernst. As they come steaming through Latitude Homes, onto Quick Lube. Down past me. Into Bendigo Bank they go. Guy Finch has got a Day Stevens all over it. A Day just playing the steering wheel, just getting it right. Through sight fix they go. Onto JG Gardner Holmes. Now they're steaming back towards Heron Todd White. The chicane through Adams Earthworks. Onto Big Bretto's, the main straightaway. It's still White from Metcalf, some Stevens in the KA4 Junior Lights. 43 4 to Damien White. Metcalf's a 43 7. Stevens a 43 7. Portelli a 43 8. Finch a 43 8. 44 0 to Brennan. 44 8 to Joey Metcalf. 45 to Charlie Anderson. Mason the missile. There he is. A 43 8 7 6. Spurway 45 4 9 0 still. They all head up towards Sight Fix and then on to JG Gardner. Here is Dan the Man Spurway. Heading now through Latitude Homes onto Quick Loop. Now he's going to come past me and steaming into Bendigo Bank and anchor it up hard. Through he goes. Whoa, miles away from the apex of the corner. And on he goes onto Sight Fix. Then through goes the flying. Cody Metcalf leading the train, but he cannot get with Damien White at the minute. 
Damien White is just ahead now of Cruz and Missile Mason on track. Did Cruz let him through? I'm not sure. Down they go down, the Heron Todd chicane. Onto Adams Earthworks, the final turn. Then onto Big Bretto's main straight away. Getting the head down. Mason then, the missile. Whoa, the Mason, the bump of love. Gives David White a little tunnel as he goes in to the home loan specialist sweeper. Let's him know he's there, but he's still quickest on track as Cruz. And it's still White, Metcalf, Stevens, Portelli, Finch. Brennan, Metcalf, Ernst in the KA4 Junior Lights. Who goes the 51 of Joey Metcalf? Hammers it now down towards Sight Fix. Right with him is Charlie Ernst. Follows him through there, through JG Gardner's homes. That is five minutes and 22 seconds gone. Plenty of time still, but a 43, 4, 8, 5. The quickest cart on track is Damien White. Through goes Metcalf, Finch. Portelli, in between them was Stevens. Then, Brennan goes through behind Brennan. There is the quickest cart, Damien White with the missile. Mason right behind him. Then following them, it was still Metcalf and Ern still locked together in this qualifying session. Meanwhile, Dan Big Brad goes, oh, we've got several going in. Portelli's gone in, Brennan's gone in. Oh no, it wasn't Brennan, actually, that was Stevens has gone in. So we'll see who else it was, but at the moment now, we've got Brennan and right behind him, White and the Missile. He moves over, lets them through. Oh, let's one through, but not all. Six minutes, 14 done, still in the KA4 Junior Lights. It is White, Metcalf, Stevens, Portelli, Finch, Brennan, Metcalf, Ernst, your order. Mason, 43-6, spur away, down the man, 45-490. All peeling in, all mighty early, all gone in. So, do they continue? There's one continue, Brennan definitely continues, and the missile, has continued as well. So Cruz, Mason, getting more lap time in. Following now, Kai Brennan on towards Sight Fix. Sorry, Latitude. Then they're gonna come down Quick Loop. Ryan Quick Loop, there he goes. He's got the hand up, he's going in. So he lets him know that he's gonna pull in after this one. So Kai Brennan just lets Cruz go through. Then. Metcalf and Ernst continue what they're doing in this qualifying session. Through they go then, onto Site Fix, then to JG Gardner. The missile continues and does another lap. And what does Metcalf and Ernst do? They continue on as well. 44.8, 5 1, and a 44.8, 9 0 between them. Provisional results are in. So that is. Qualifying completed in KA3 Juniors, the Missile Mason, 43, gives the hand 10, 43, 6, 8, 6, 2. Danny Spurway in the KA4 Junior Heavy, a 45, 4, 9, 0. In the KA4 Junior Light, your pole sitter, Damian White. On the front row with him, Cody Metcalf. On the second row, Dane Stevens and Jury Portelli. On the third row, Jai Finch and Kai Brennan. And off the fourth row, Joey Metcalf and Charlie Ernst. That was how they finished in group number two.